So in, in a business then, who should be responsible for that kind of you know data life cycle piece? Because uh, you know, if you look at a traditional whatever industry business, they're focused on staying profitable, providing a service, keeping the lights on, that kind of thing. IT, IT managers and IT teams internally or MSPs are focused on keeping the lights on. They're probably not really the, the kind of people that are going to dive in and look at, oh, actually, we don't need this driver's license from 12 years ago. Who in a business should do that? I think it's a bit of a crossover because you, sometimes you'll get the reason that they're collecting it is more marketing. So they want to know about mm. their customers, their customer base. So I think it's probably a lot of the time they've got the data. So it's a bit hard to go back and sort of sanitize. So it's just somebody's got to be given that sort of responsibility. And I don't think it's IT's responsibility either or even cybersecurity is it needs to be back into a business function of who's using the data. If it's their data, they own the data. Someone has to own the data inside mm. the organization. It should be their job to go back and clean it up. But particularly in the marketing space, I think they someone should sit there and it should be a directive to go stop collecting the information you don't need. Yes, we know that you indicate there could be some potential value, but minimize what you collect, make that sort of right conscious decision for your clients going, okay, we really don't need this. It doesn't actually give us any real value. Just the fact that we feel like one day it could be useful. Mm. So yeah, just minimize that impact, take that sort of business choice of going, this is the right decision for both us and our clients moving forward to mm. stop collecting that kind of stuff. Do the validations, then eradicate.